Microsoft will be ending its peer-to-peer network very soon, if not already. They've been dealing with security issues and reliability problems throughout the years, and I guess they're going to be minimized. We'll see how everything works. Basically, Skype is going to be going the traditional client-server route, and this means that a lot of older operating systems will no longer be supported. iOS 8, Windows XP, Android 4.03, and OS X Yosemite users are all safe, as are anybody with a newer operating system. And really, that's all well and good because there are other Skype alternatives out there, including the good old telephone, (laughs) but there is other software out there that's like Skype, and you can still use it on really old operating systems. The other unfortunate thing about this move is that you can no longer send files directly to another person via Skype. In the past, I've used Skype to send massive amounts of video files to other people, and it's worked out pretty well. So we'll just have to wait and see how this new system works, if it's just as fast, which I highly doubt, because a direct connection A direct point from point A to point B is always the best route, always the fastest route, I should say. But we'll have to see. At least it's more secure and people can't get my IP address. On the other hand, there's a lot of people who are talking about the government spying on people, which is a very realistic concern in this day and age. But hey, I bet you they could have spied on you before, which I always say the only way to really have a private conversation these days is in a noisy restaurant or a noisy nightclub whispering into somebody's ear because then somebody who has a uh, microphone, you know, they're wearing a wire, as they say in the movies, they can't hear that because it's so loud. You know, all that ambient noise from other people is so loud. That's your only privacy at this point in time, thanks to the internet and thanks to technology in general being so advanced that everything's being recorded. Everything is stored for decades and that's just how things are nothing's private anymore on the internet like i said you have to whisper in a crowded room if you expect actual privacy 